Hello and welcome to the Daily Bible Podcast. My name is William Hemsworth. Thank you so much for joining me for today's episode. Well, today we continue on into Matthew chapter 10. Today we're going to look at Matthew chapter 10 verses 7 through 8. And as you may recall, Jesus has just called his disciples and he's commissioning them to go and do great things you know, for the sake of the gospel, for Christ. And so this is where we pick up. So again, we're going to look at Matthew chapter 10, verses 7 through 8, which say, As you go, proclaim the good news. The kingdom of heaven has come near. Cure the sick, raise the dead, cleanse the lepers, cast out demons. You received without payment. Give without payment. So key thing here is Jesus just got done you know, curing the sick, raising the dead, all these types of things in Matthew chapter 8 and Matthew chapter 9. And here we are in chapter 10. He's commissioning his disciples to do the very same thing. Yeah, the same signs of the kingdom that Jesus performed in chapters 8 and 9 will now be done by the disciples. In chapter 8, we read about, you know, do this without pay. So the kingdom was given to the disciples freely. And to sell that message would insult God and would not the and it wouldn't give the impression that the gospel was a free gift. You know, Jesus tells them later on in the next couple verses that their needs will be sustained, that they will be provided for. Now Paul later Later on in the New Testament, Paul refuses financial support from those from those that he came to evangelize, while he accepted support from the more established churches, and he also directed them to provide for their teachers. And we see that in a few places. One is first Corinthians chapter nine, verses twelve through eighteen, Philippians chapter four, verses fourteen through nineteen, and Galatians six six. So this is not an admonition from Jesus to not, to not, you know, give donations or to pay the disciples. What he's telling the disciples is not to sell the gospel. So if someone were to come up to the disciples and say, um, you know, I want to learn more about Jesus and the disciples say, well, great, give me a steak first. No, that's, that's kind of what Jesus is talking about. If someone were to you know, it's kind of the same today. We read in the Gospel of Luke that the laborer deserves his wage. So those who work in churches, our priests, our pastors, etc. That's their livelihood. That is how they feed their families. They're not they're not getting rich. I mean there's some out there that are, and that's a whole other debate. But for the most part, that parish down the street, that church down the street Those that work in the church are not getting rich off the church. The worker deserves the wage, their wage. They're not selling the gospel. They're not denying the gospel to people who come in. The gospel is a free gift. So let's not go, let's remember that the gospel is a free gift for all of us. And that free gift should be freely given to others. Let's tell people about the gospel. Let's tell people about Jesus. But let's do so, let's do so realizing that it is a free gift that has been given to us by God. And we have, just like Jesus told his disciples to give it as a free gift, he's telling us today to give it as a free gift. God bless you guys. Thank you for listening to this edition of the Daily Bible Podcast. As always, if you have any questions, comments, prayer requests, please email me at hopewithin18 at gmail.com. God bless you guys. Have a great day.